What's up everybody? Welcome back. This is Final Hydra and State of Decay 2 is now out. I'm so excited to show this game to you guys. I've been waiting for it pretty much since the first State of Decay and now it's out. Now I get it a little bit earlier than most people I guess because I bought the special edition. So without further ado, let's jump right in. For those of you who never played State of Decay, it is a zombie survival sandbox game kind of. Uh, where it takes the focus away from like the player character being like the the one-man army and brings it back to the community building aspect of the game where everybody's kind of an average Joe and nobody's unkillable or you know indispensable so let's get into this new community Ooh, I can't wait I've seen so much stuff about this game as it's come out and it, uh, as it's been like in development and as like information has come out I've been very excited Ooh, okay what do I get to pick? Choose your characters. A tutorial scenario. All right. Old buddies. Joel and... Oh, okay. So we get two to start. Survived on a train into nostalgia. All right. What else I got? Oh, we got Brandon and Ever. Her name is Ever. Okay. Perpetual breakup. All right. Old buddies. Let's see. Brandon seems... He's, he's a human potato. What? <laughs> Alright, so Brandon seems really good at shooting. Joel seems like he's a good mechanic. That sounds good. Okay, I was thinking about these guys. We got Brandon. If not for zombies, you would have never found love. The two of you met in the woods, surviving from survivors from different worlds with no home to go back to. Throw, though your roads might never have crossed, you are now inseparable. As you approach an army refugee camp, you hope the same apocalypse that brought you together doesn't tear you apart. Hmm. Alright, so nobody here is good at shooting. But Brandon here seems like he's a pretty good fighter. I'm thinking we'll go with this group. We'll try them out. I got the star-crossed lovers here. El Romeo and Juliet. The Romeo and Juliet of the zombie world. Shit, shit, shit! Oh my god, profanity. Let's go, let's go! Uh oh. Go, 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 go! Alrighty. Oh, check this shit out. That muerto's got no skin. That muerto's got no skin. That gate won't last long. All right, so apparently Brandon here is a uh, of Spanish uh, we origin. On our own. Right. The woods were way better than an army base stocked with food. Okay. I like that idea. All right, let's find some food and shelter. Let's go. All right, figuring out all this stuff. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. These guys literally just spawned in. I get it. Like, this is the tutorial, so I imagine that this is going to be a little... Ugh. Shit. There's brainless in here. How'd they get inside? There's Maybe that's brainless. There's nobody here. Yeah, I would guess there's nobody here the because of Where the Zambinas. Looks like they left in a hurry, too. All right, let's search. Get some supplies now. We could do fast search, but that's gonna make noise. If I know anything, oh, <coughs> ah, excuse me. Oh, we use some bandages. I don't really think I needed to use any bandages, but I mean, whatever. This guy, does he see me? Oh, jeez. Can we stab him in the dome, please, and get this guy out of here? Oh. Alright, so that's my dodge button, so to speak. Alright, dead. Alright, is he dead? Nope, still moving. Get him in the face! Right in the face. Alright, let's search this box. Alright, found items. Bag of snacks. I'll take that. 
take a little bit bit of snackies fast search what do we got all right bandages definitely worth having more of those right can't go wrong with bandages What did you break? Like, ah, I'm looking through a cooler and I dropped the only thing of lemonade in a glass Look bottle. Around. We should try to find you a better weapon. Yeah, considering mine is broken, girl. Hiya! Hiya! This guy is pretty decent at the fighting aspect. I do like that. Alright. I'm okay with the fast search because it's the tutorial. I'm not that worried. Let's say. Oh, I'm taking this with me. This is my car now. I'm not that worried about getting like destroyed in the tutorial area. Although maybe I should be worried, you know. That would that would be like the biggest lull into a, like a false this is sense of security. The shittiest refugee camp I've ever seen. How Don't many refugee camps have you seen? Like she's like, oh, this is the worst. Oh, there we go. All right. Yeah, my bat's broken. So how do I put it there? Qué bueno. Okay, open inventory, equip, there we go. Alright, so now we've got a new weapon, that's good. I'm just gonna quickly, the game volume's a little loud for me, I'm just gonna turn it down just a tiny bit. Boom, there we go. Alright. Ooh, 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 those look like weapons crates, can I search them? Of course not, That would. that's like where the assault rifles are, right there. Can't get that in the tutorial, that'd make it too easy. Got some more snacks. I mean, so far this is the best refugee camp I've ever been to. It's filled with snacks, no retreat. Hey, check out these notes. You know, I'd write one for you if you got lost. Why am I the one who's gonna get lost? Cause I'm okay. the- Okay, you can write one for me then. Damn. Damn. Whatever. Thanks for fantasizing about me going MIA. Let's just Nobody was thinking about that lady. Calm it down. Note from Searcher's Wall. The retreat is wrong. We took an oath to protect these people. We cannot abandon them in their hour of need. Join our cause. Save our nation. We are Red Talon. Okay, that's a little weird. I don't know what's going on with that, but uh, it doesn't sound like it did these folks any good. Medical supplies. Got some more bandages. Up, oh, more brainless deadheads, zambarinas. All right, all right, we got this. Boom, boom. Get them while they're down. That's the easy way to get them. Ah, right in the face. All right. At least we don't have to search the zambinos. Like that would just overcomplicate things. I feel like if. Every, if every time you killed one, you had like pockets to search or something weird. I well, I imagine that that would definitely add to like the realism of some part of the game. Like I don't know, that, I just feel like there's so many zombies that you will probably kill in the game. If you had to look through every one of their pockets, place? it would probably be a little annoying. Locked up. There we go. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm swinging and I can't hit this thing. Jesus. He's just like that muerto we saw outside the gate. Ah, damn it. Hit me. I hate that. Yeah, we both had worse. Do I have to worry about her? Are you okay, girl? Damn, she ain't gonna make it. She just got bit. Like, isn't that, like, the whole thing? You get bit by the Zambinas, it's over? We gotta start digging your grave, like, that day? Actually, I don't remember that from State of Decay 1. Like, the zombies are definitely a problem, but, like, their bite isn't, like, a death sentence for whatever reason. I think that's, like, the only time I've ever seen that in, like, zombie lore where a bite is not, like, literally, like, the be-all, end-all to your life. Uh, Camp Osbury guidelines. No fires, vandalism, or unruly behavior. No use of facilities. Okay. Report any illnesses or death immediately. Okay. Please set more rules in fucking high school. I doubt it. High school's got a lot of rules, bruh. Shit. 
this bite is really itching. I'm sorry. I'll be faster next time. Yeah, the fact that her bite is itching. Anybody else sensing an issue there? Neil. What the fuck is all this? this is a, wow. Oh, I like that finisher. That was a good one. That shit is nasty. I mean, you did it, so you know maybe don't get it on your hands next time. There. I'm out of meds, but I'll find you something. Don't worry. All right. We gotta find meds forever. Ooh. I don't know what that means. I assume that that means yay, I found a machete. If that's not yay, I found a machete, well, then I don't know what's right anymore. We can make it. Just keep quiet. Alright. Ooh. Stealth assassin, baby. Alright. Jeez, this guy's like a combat, like, expert. He's like tripping zombies, like, all stealth-like. He's stabbing them in the face holes. Oh no. Yo up here. Get to the ladder. All right there. Let's go. Let's go. Get out of my way, hoodie guy. I, I don't even actually know if that was a zombie. I just started hitting it. Come on, ever. Wait, what are you doing here? The last evac trucks left days ago. My girl heard the army ran these camps. Where is everybody? Orders came in to close these camps down and move on. No more army, my man. Not here. No Just more army. Just a few of us dumb enough to stay behind. Only me and the doc survive. Hey, not an exaggeration. My brain is on fire. Oh, shit. Tell me what bitter. Was this real nasty fucker? All covered in blood? What's wrong? This is bad. Real bad. You need serious help. The doc should still be down at the s &B. Okay. Tell her I sent you. Glad to help. Thanks for your help there, friend. Alright. Come on, girl. We gotta go, go, go. Your brain is literally on fire. That's probably not good. Ooh. I'm over that. Oh, good. You look like a doctor to me. Where did you two come from? I thought civilians had been gone for days. Still trying to be. Was your friend bitten? That's yeah, she was girl. definitely bitten. Look at her. It was a zombie with blood on the outside. I'm so sorry. You should come with me. Why? Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. I feel like this is not going to go oh, well. That's what bit me. One of those things. It's called blood plague. It's very contagious, and it doesn't take long to do its job. What do you mean? That's gonna happen to me? Not as long as I'm around. Hey, I could use your help. This thing is pretty gross looking. Uh, it doesn't have skin, it looks like. Take your flashlight, go in there and look for a sample case. I need you to bring it to me. Oh. Before I lost my team, we were learning all we could about blood plague. We developed a cure, but it only works if you use it soon after infection. The army took our lab when they left, but they didn't get everything. This is just a room of bodies. It's a little gross. Did you find it? Here you go. Can Blood plague sure? samples. Not good. I'll need an infirmary to culture a new dose. Hey, Doc, it's checkout time. Fucking Zeds are swarming the perimeter. Plague zombies, too. I know you want to save Amari, but it's not for us to bounce. I guess Amari's the one in the, the cage. We have a treatment. Exactly. Don't let that legacy die here. Other survivors are gonna need your help, like her. I guess the cage here is okay. somebody she knows. But I can't just leave. 
Not like this. Do what you need to, but make it fast. I'm sorry to ask this, but I need your help. Yes? I'm going to save your girlfriend if I can. Because no one deserves what happened to Amari. But I don't have the strength to end things. Alright, so what happened? She gave me a gun. Equip the gun. Oh. That was probably like her her husband or something. over you. I know I have a hard time letting people take care of me. For what it's worth, I'm glad we're together. Yeah, come on, girl, stay with me. We're gonna be fine. I'm the apocalypse without you. Thank you for doing what I couldn't. You, you don't even know that I did it, go. lady. Let's head to the town in the foothills. We should try. The okay, we need to find a place to set it down. There's three towns here. One's up in the foothills. Another is in the plateau. The last one is down in the valley. Maybe we'll do the plateau. Sounds good. I'm riding shotgun. I hope your driving is good. My driving is probably not good, but we'll figure that out right away, won't we? All right, here we go, folks. I guess this is through the tutorial, and out we go. Where's my horn? No more army, huh? If so, I can't honk the horn, what's the point? Oh, now? I'm not even doing this. Hey, come on. As long as we're together. We can make it through anything. I'm not even driving right now. <laughs> it's just totally doing it. That's why I can't honk the horn. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm excited. I like it. So the tutorial level, in my opinion, was... Eh. I mean, I get it. It set us up for, like, this new Blood Plague zombie and stuff like that. Because uh, those weren't in the first game, I don't think. But, uh, yeah, you know, it was all right. It definitely was a... I mean, the first game had, like, no tutorial whatsoever. Just kind of was like, hey, there's zombies. Deal with it, bro. Damn. We're out of gas. Guess we better start scavenging. I mean, did we need gas? More Probably. More won't help us now. No? Why? The way that blood plague is progressing, your friend won't last long without a place to rest. My girlfriend, not oh, my friend. I have literally never felt worse in my life. She's a badass. You Look at her spiked place jacket. To down. Now. For once, the army and I agree. It's time to get off the road and find a home. Okay. Some place we can build what we need to keep your friend from dying. Oh, wow. Well, you know, let's be... She's right here. We could, you know, maybe use a little bedside manner. Maybe we'll walk aside here and talk about death, all right? Okay. Uh, we will do... I saw Friends a decent only. home site right before we ran What is out happening of gas? here? Sounds like a plan. We shouldn't stay out here for long. Better be careful. Catching the plague would really cramp my style. All right. Let's do this. Open the map for an overview. Oh my god. What is going on here? So you guys can't see this, but I'm getting like a thousand and one pop-ups from Microsoft right now about this. So, okay, we can make a home right here. We can go there. Is there anywhere else we can make a home? Wow, this place is big. Okay, so we can go directly ahead and do that. All right, let's start. Are they following me? They, oh, two of them are, okay. We got some zombies down there in the in the ravine. We don't need to go that way. God damn, man, we got company. Boom! Get out of my face, lady. <coughs> oh. oh, excuse me. I apologize. How horrible. Yeah, I got I got some zombie blood in my nose. Had to, you know, sneeze it out. Hey, who's that over there? Who's that over where? That's a blood plague zombie, obvi. You can see the red eyes. Or are we talking this way? No, these are zombies on rocks. I wish I knew what the hell this guy was talking about, because I really don't. I want to look for some stuff real quick, see if I can't... Oh, whoa, 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 that's a person! 
Who looks enough. suspiciously like our doctor? You can't carry that. You been well? Hello, Kate. Kate, D oh yeah, I'm not gonna be able to figure that one out. Her name. All right, learn about the survivor. Perfect. So now we've got like a relationship built up a little been bit. Well? Learn. Is there anything I can do? Like, can we speak? Can we converse? Hey there. Trade with us. her. Sure, sounds good. What does she have? She's got bottles of painkillers, energy drinks, and forty-five caliber rounds. What does my pistol use? I don't actually even know. The PPK. I'm pretty sure this is a nine millimeter. Uh, this is a twenty-two caliber round. That's pretty horrible. Okay, so. What can I trade to this lovely lady here? I've got a broken wooden bat. Would she like that? She apparently would. Hmm. There's some circuitry here. That's worth a lot. Look at that. We'll probably need it, though. Maybe it's best to not sell the circuitry this early in the game. But I was trying to build up my relationship a little bit with her. Shop teacher, I hope he's a zombie. An eight-fingered zombie dickhead. Wow. Very specific. Where did this Kate girl go? Is she just hanging out in this uh, location? or I just want to search a couple stuff. See if there's anything good, you know? Oh, baby. Got me a handgun. This also looks like it could be a uh, gun box of some kind. Like if I had a room and I had a nice wooden box in it, I would keep a gun with ammo in it or something cool. Nada. Nada? That sucks. All right, Kate, what's How's my relationship? Going? Enlist. We need a better relationship, apparently. I don't know how I can have a better relationship with you. We'll, we'll come back, we'll come back. It's right here. We're going to go up here, I think, to build our home. Now, this is the... I'm going to equip the better gun. Yeah. Look at this. It's got, like, a little scopey. Yo, what the fuck? What? What are we... What are we... What are we yelling about there, buddy? Yo, that spot could be the new digs. It's got a nice wall on it. I like it. Out the zombies. We can get a close look. <laughs> Ended. All right, over the tiny little wall. There we go. Come on, fight him. There we go. Okay, securing a building. We have to secure all the parts of it. It'll just fuck you up. We are gonna have to have a visual confirmation that there are no more Zambinos inside the premises. I hear them. I can hear it somewhere. Oh god, he scared me. Dead? Looks dead. Coast looks clear. This place looks good to me. All right, I thought there was gonna be. Before someone else shows up. I was really actually kind of worried hey, that. Doc, we found a spot that should work well as our new home base. Nice work. Once you claim the site, my patient and I will meet you there. We've claimed it, haven't we? Oh, interact with the claim point right here. All right, this is our this is our new home. Let's do it. Woo! Did we clean it up a little? To build an infirmary. Build an infirmary. Treat this illness and eventually make the cure. Okay. Unfortunately, we don't have oh, the God. resources we need to build it. Okay. We go teach that asshole a lesson. 
I hear a zombie somewhere. Dude, girl, you're like aid blood plague victim. Gotta get me a doctor before I need a priest. Yeah. Just hold on there, ever. We'll put supply locker. So what do I got? Did I actually get? I got some circuitry, so we're gonna put that in here. Put the 22, and I don't need that. Nine millimeter, I kind of need. Put these weird notes in there. Bandages, I'll keep. I'll put this one back in. Perfect. Okay, so now talk to Juan. Juan. Hey, Juan. Uh, all right, we really didn't clean up this room at all. It's a little disgusting. Not gonna lie. Uh, but we should get on that. That should be priority one to clean up our home. Oh wow, Juan, you're, you're sitting in the dark. Without an infirmary, we'll lose, we'll lose every blood plague. Okay, I saw a cell tower nearby that should give us a good view. Okay. I'm sure you'll be fine, hun. All right. We've got four beds. All right. So travel to the cell tower and survey the area. Where's that at? Uh, over here. Right. I'm basically facing it, aren't I? Oh, this is so cool. So all these little areas here that are like, they've got Catch like the little later, reticle guys. around them. I can build stuff there. All right. Where is the cell tower that she speaks of? Healing. The oh, this is the cell tower. Okay. Oh, I see it now. Now I can see it perfectly as if it was always right there. All right. So that's the new goal. Maybe get that zombie off the basketball thing. That that should be a high priority goal as well, I feel. All right. We got to save ever. That's my girl. Whoop. Is that what's that called? Gun. I thought it was called gun and shop, and it, it's actually just called gun shop because that would just be stupid to call it the other thing. All right. Cardio, it's baby. Cool. We're getting better at it. Searching. What is this? Oh, we don't have the uh, we don't have the points yet for it. Okay. But this is an outpost, apparently. I guess we could post somebody up top, and they would scout the area for us. That would be probably pretty cool. Jeez, this is a uh up now. Alright, survey from a tower fills the map up. I always forget how to do this. Okay, I'll just use my gun, that's fine. Yes, I could make a solid outpost. Fruit stand, hey, that's look, always good. Screamer. That's not good. We don't want one of those again. That was our car, right? That could be useful. Red garage. We'll just keep filling up these points so that we know where oh, stuff is on the map. Dibs on the driver's seat. All right, so this guy likes cars. We know. All right, keep it moving. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Gonna search that box most definitely. But we're looking for something that's going to have the supplies that we need to build this infirmary so that we can save my girlfriend. I mean, I just got her. I don't want to I don't want to lose her already. That'll do it for now. All right. That's worth taking. What did I get? Ooh. I like that actually. That's like a nice axe. All right. At least we can descend much faster than we ascended. Scavenge nearby buildings for a rust sack of materials. All right. I just want to double check. Yeah, we cannot claim this. Yeah, we can't do that. That's probably later on anyway. Let's just keep it moving. Thankfully, this zombie here is blind as a bat and can't see me. 
I mean, I think everybody here knows it goes without saying where I'm heading next. Yeah, get the hell out of my face, kid. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Nope, nothing there to search. It's a very it's a very tiny store, I just want to say. It looks like uh, people definitely did their fair share of searching already. Everything's been ta I mean, you know, a gun shop. Like, that's obvious. Zombies is where everybody's gonna go. Did anybody leave anything? Oh, I got a Molotov and some parts. That's good. This can also be an outpost. Wow, it's dark in here. Holy crap, it gets dark. Alright, there are five more containers. You know, we might find something good. Getting more and more parts. It's all good stuff. All good stuff, I think. At risk of making noise if we search quickly. I don't want to search too quick. More parts. Jesus, I'm just going to get a lot of dang parts. Alright, this stuff back here looks promising. This is where I would keep guns and metal cabinets, right? Unlocked, though, so that anybody can just walk in and, you know, search them if they want. That's fine. Nothing found, alright. That makes sense, that makes sense. Somebody came in here, looted, and then closed it back up like a jerk to fool the next guy. I'm, I'm with you. 44 Magnum rounds. I'll take it. Don't have that gun, but, you know, I might eventually have that gun. Alright, there's apparently one more container in this store somewhere. Somewhere in this store, there's a container for me to search. Oh, right here. That's a nice rifle case. Nice looking pelican case right there. Come on. Come on. Give me the money. Alright, what is this? This is a, another 22. We'll take it. That's too much, man. That's too much, man. What don't I want? It's nine. That's magnum parts. That's usually probably good. It's a hard toss-up. There's a lot of 22 ammunition here. I'm going to put the machete down, right? I don't think I need that right now. That's too much, man. It's too much. I can't even pick it all up. All right. What is this? Take the... Well, that's the machete. Right, we can come back. We're, we literally live up the hill. What's this? Okay, so we've got that. I can take my waypoint off of there. Let's get this back to the house. Oh, well, you can search that car for stuff, too. Let's get this back. Because it's I got this big old pack of ammo on my back. I think I ought to rest. We'll do this. And then we'll find those medical supplies. I'm sorry. It's like, I'm going to come home. And they'll be like, did you find the medicine? No, but look at this. I got a big bag of guns. And they're going to be like, but I need medicine. I'll be like, but guns. So many guns. There we go. There we go. Lots of good stuff. Withdrawal, Russex, sword ammo, load, scrap, materials for parts. All right. All that good stuff. And now, I'm going to give you all this good stuff. So I guess I'll put the 9mm away. I don't need that. I've got this nice little 22 in my pocket. Interesting. Interesting. I'm a little confused at what just happened here. That's too much, man. Definitely want that, and I want the ammunition for it again. Can't carry that. Why can I not? Oh, do I not have a backpack equipped? Aha! Didn't have a backpack equipped. Interesting. All right. So we'll take some of that, and I think I'm good. P20, P220 Elite. I'm not 100% sure what that is. All right. 
Gotta we find nearby home, buildings. And we shouldn't kill ourselves trying to. I found a couple of things while I was out scavenging. I'm thinking we'll go to this building down there. That one looks halfway decent. I mean, it's one of the potentials for uh, the supplies that we need, so. I'm surprised the, uh, the mini mart there is not a potential. Like, you know, those have, like, some medical supplies in them, right? Like, something like that. At least some uh, Advil on the shelves. Probably don't need Advil to heal this girl, though. If you can fix Blood Plague with Advil, I feel like Blood Plague deserves to get cured, you know? All right. A little bit of storage area here. Let's keep it looking. Keep it fresh. Oh, that's carpentry stuff. Yes, what's up? I'm glad to hear it. Good to hear. All right. Let's check here. Who knows what we'll find. We might get another rust sack of material, right? Of oh, parts. Grab that. Alright, I'm super du duper weighed down right now. Alright. Let's get... This guy's just got a hammer. Dude, apparently you can just make anything a uh an outpost here i'm getting some cardio work in baby because i've got like a i've got literally just got a bag of weights on my back it's like all carpentry stuff so it's like what two by fours and hammers all right supply locker and then what we're gonna build the infirmary properly there we go okay and you can build simple facilities such as the infirmary for advanced facilities and upgrades you need survivors with special perks. Seek out, recruit new survivors. Okay. Start construction on an infirmary. Should the infirmary be in the house? Outside the house? I'm not 100% sure. Where do we want it? The bathroom there would probably, probably be pretty good for an infirmary, I would think. It'll take a while for us to finish putting up the infirmary. In the meantime, we should look around for more supplies. We can use the radio to organize searches for things we need. Alright. Using your radio. Every survivor carries a radio, okay? You need a resource uh, or a recruit, you can use the radio to track that down. Some survivors offer radio commands that heal, supply, or rain down fire. I think about recovering the car we abandoned. It's still perfectly drivable if you can refuel it. Oh, is my pockets literally filled with stuff? I I dropped off the rust sack, but I didn't take all the the parts and stuff. All right. I'm worried. That, fucking loud. Well, one, I just smashed my character through the front door of our base, which was not exactly the best idea ever. This looks super cool. It's got like a better impact than our. It's also got knockdown. No dismemberment. We're gonna take that. Put that in the base. Portable generator. As long as we have gas, we can power. We have power. Install this mount and supply with fuel to power a single facility. Okay. Put that in there. That's probably like super useful for later on. Alright, so remember that girl Kate was over here. Let's go check her out. See what she's up to. Maybe now that we have this facility, you know, like our home set up, we might be able to convince this girl that it might be better to, you know, join up with us or something. How have you been? Threaten? Whoa, I don't know if we want to do that. What you got for me? Of course. Same stuff she had pretty much. All right. Same stuff I sold her as well. All right. Can I search her stuff or is this... case of chemicals if I take this am I stealing from her big question big questions I don't really know I think she's kind of solo so I'm just gonna search this building That's worth taking. oh another another handgun I'll take it all 
Gardener's toolkit, I'll take it. That was pretty good, man. I'm just finding guns and stuff left and right. Man, I'm a good finder, I guess. Check ever into the infirmary. All right. You can't carry that. Oh, I'm filled up already. Damn, I was really hoping to find, uh, like, food or something in here. But I guess, you know, that would require me to check the actual kitchen. Oh, there's nothing here. <laughs> uh, there's one more box in here that I have not searched, apparently. Oh, it's this one. Might as well do it. Search it while I'm here. Go back, check her into the infirmary, because we're right there. Might as well just do it. Make sure she's safe, you know? this place over. That's too much, man. Hmm. Damn, I actually learned something useful there. Cool. So this guy just learned mechanic skills, apparently. Faded brown house. Sorry, faded brown house. All right. Here we go. Keep working that cardio, buddy. Keep it up. We'll go back to the house. We'll check Kate into the infirmary. Or, not Kate. Kate's the girl we just left. Ever. Where is she? And how do I do that? Alright. One. Facility mod. Oh, I'm gonna fuck you up. What is... Who is yelling in my house? Oh, no, I needed those. Those are for my gun. I think 10 rounds is good for the gun. I don't need to bring all my ammo with me, you know? All right. Use infirmary. Action. Stabilize blood plague. Kate. I keep calling her Kate. Her name is Ever. Ah! I'm bad. Okay, keep blood plague victims in your infirmary to halt the progress of the... If you can bring them the cure, you can use it to save their lives. If you can't, you may need to kill them. Ooh. Ooh. It's all right, Ever. Just, you stay here. I see you folks are my new neighbors. Could one of you come by to help me out with something? Oh, isn't that the girl that's like... They probably know a lot about this area. We could use a friend like that. See if they can help us find more meds. We need them to treat our patients until we can make the cure. Dude, I've already met her. We've already made contact. We're, me, me and Kate, we're already, we're already homies. Gotta snuff it out. There it is. He's dead. Yeah, we, we, oh, whoa, whoa, homie, you got people in your house. You gotta sort your 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 home out here, Kate. Hello. I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a lot of zombies infesting. Uh, we'd both be safer if you help me clear them out. Oh yeah, let's do it. Infestations like this are pretty dangerous. If you need some extra ammunition, I have a few rounds to spare. No, I'm okay. Out infestations now and again, they spread all over. Then they become a serious problem. Entiendo. Travel with... Where is she bringing... Oh, no, that's not... Oh. Not-so-friendly neighbors. Okay, so we're heading this way. Got it. <laughs> Stealth kill! In your face. This house here looks pretty dope, too. Like, this would have been a nice place to bunker down. It looks like uh, the windows are already boarded up. Okay, let's just... We'll try, to, we'll try to skate around this, dude. Nope, didn't work. Oh, my gosh. I just literally just pushed through his head. All right. The facility we need to Okay, we're getting close. If you can, take out the screamer first. Otherwise, it'll just draw more zombies. When I see it, I will do so.
All right, so where's this screamer? Hey, what are you doing? Hey, you want to back me up here? Anything? Jeez, girl. Just let the thing get me, why don't you, next time? Now, I'm seeing a little indicator on the map that the Screamer's, like, over this way, so I'm trying to, like, get around him, maybe get him in the head with the 22. Oh, you almost got me. Got him. See, Kate, that's teamwork. I'm helping the team. I knew you could do it, huh? All right. Primary currency of the frontier is influence. You can earn influence by completing goals, trading, helping other players. Well, I I helped. Kate, you we can wait. Her mom. Don't worry, we got this. Kate, why don't you shut up? All right. You know, I need medicine. I got somebody who's sick that means something to me. Unlike you, you don't mean anything to me. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Sanitizing machine. Damn, this shit is heavy. I guess I'm over encumbered again already. Clear the building, Kate. Come on. Rule number one. Close the front door, Kate. Jeez, you savage. All right. Still one more area of this place we haven't explored. There's a couple containers I want to check. Jug of ethanol. We got a sanitizing machine. I mean, this is a printer. What am I going to get out of this? Oh, some lady in the office was stashing Advil behind the ink tray. That's good. That's too much, man. All right. Um... Medical advice? The medical experts talk you through taking cover health and move trust. Oh, okay. It's stuck and can't move around. This backtracks you a bit. Oh, okay, that's super cool. Huh. That's all cool stuff that I got for being, uh, the... For, like, pre-ordering, I guess. Interesting. I'm not gonna use any of that just yet. Oh! Good job there, Kate. You, you're helping the team a little more every day. Smoke grenade. That's super cool. Alright, so this place has been... We've searched it. Alright, let's check in with the girl. Blood plague? Yes. I've lost friends to that, too. You should know that medicine just delays the inevitable. I'm sorry. Kate? No, no, it's okay. We know how to cure it. We just need to keep her alive until we can make the cure. Kate, you got... You, you got, have a cure for blood play? You're not really making me feel Wish good here. I met you folks a month ago. Some of my friends might still be alive. Everybody here is no, Debbie Downer. We don't Downers. actually have the cure on hand just yet. We need to gather one more ingredient before we can craft it. What is it? What Cocoa Puffs. Maybe I can help. Yo, this may sound crazy. We need tissue samples from plague zombies. We have a few samples from this army lab back at the refugee camp, but the doc says we need more. All right, do so you have any in your pocket? You need plague zombies? Well, I can point you in the right direction. All right. Take care. Oh, okay, cool. She's just done. Excellent. So I thought there was a way to use the radio. Supply drops. Just mail it. Oh, available once per community. Available once per community. Available once per community. Once per community. Once per community. That's not what I need. I wanted to see if... I could call... To see if, like, 
anybody at the base would come out. I know that that used to be a thing in the other game, but I think you had to build a special facility before that was available. So that's probably uh, similar in this game. Like, basically, you could call the base and they would send out one of the uh, guys at the at the camp who's not doing anything right now. And like, if you found like too many resources for you to carry or something weird like that. That might be something available, but probably just have to unlock it first. So let's just get back to camp. We'll get ever all all sorted out. I think I ought to rest. Nah, you're all right, bro. Come on, you're running on those fumes right now. It's all adrenaline, baby. We gotta save your girlfriend. There's no time for rest. This guy, I need a rest. I don't want to hear it. There we go, medical supplies. Gotta recharge. Perfect. I mean, it's not great, but we at least we got some stuff, right? Low-grade cleaning equipment used to search as well. Okay, so all this money. Affirming to improve recovery from partial blood plague infections. Requires power. All right, there we go. Everything there stocked up. Talk to Juan about preparing a cure. Figure out what's next. Let's talk to... Buena suerte, amigo. I mean, I might switch to this guy, but right now I'm doing okay with this dude, so might as well stick up with it, right? Keep on keeping on. Now, where's this girl at? Juan. Where the hell did she go? Where is this Juan at? Juan? Some Juan is looking for you. I'm generally confused as to where you may have gotten off to, because I just heard you speaking a minute ago, I think. But now I'm... Oh, I found her. We out here having a quick smoke break? Our new neighbor said there's some blood plague zombies roaming Let's nearby. Go. All right. Now we just plague samples are collected plague from the remains of plague zombies. By the red ooze that gave blood plague its name. Word. All right. Collect We're one. We're counting on you to get this job done right. All right, where are they? Is there like an area? Up here. All right. Should I bring the other dude with me? Yeah, I've got gear. I'm good. All right, we just need to kill one zombie, right? All right. Let's go kill this dang zombie. We'll get that done. And then we might end the episode there. Keep it moving there, Brandon. I can't I don't think we can get bogged down in the combat like that. The zombies seem very bad at tracking us at night, so let's just keep Oh nope. Keep hitting. We missed. Oh, got him. All right. One. We're going to bandage a little bit. Now, I just need to get a sample of this blood plague, but there are some crates here. It, it's hard to pass up good crates. Fireworks. That's useful. Oh, jeez. Surprise! Deadhead. Boom! Mashed his face right the hell in. All right, come on, get the resources. Need to search a mini mart or something Just soon. Gotta keep looking. Gotta get that food unlocked for the for the people at home. Secure the home front's food supply. An yeah, army marches on its stomach. Hand drill press. Tire out lugging this shit around. All right, let's just be cautious. If I see this blood plague zombie, uh -uh. we're gonna, we're not gonna take any chances.
Eat some snacks, bro. Okay, whoa, well, these are... These are what we needed, right? Alright, we're good. We got everything we needed, right? That's it. Might as well just do a quick search while we're here. Search the area up. I got a lot of stuff on my back. I know, that's probably like super bad, but we're traveling very heavy right now. But we searched the area. Bag of hunting ammo, that's useful. We need that. We gotta come back for this stuff. I'll pick this place over. All right, there's two more boxes in here somewhere that need to be searched. Bueno, no muertos around. We did that, we did that. Where are these other boxes at? Outside, maybe? Along the wall? Hmm. I really am surprised that I can't call for help. Yeah, these are like other players. I don't really want that. Hmm. Yeah. Weird. Alright, well. I mean, this is also a Blood Plague zombie. Oh, I guess, uh... I guess blowing their head off kind of gets it so that I don't get any resources out of their, their faces. Alright. Our dude is tired. We gotta get him back to the base. We're gonna rest up. We're gonna resupply and probably switch out characters for the next uh, for the next tasks at hand. But we got everything we need to at least help out our dear beloved uh, whatever her name is ever. <laughs> My girlfriend whose name I have mysteriously forgotten again. What's her name? Eve? Eve? <laughs> it's ever. Like, I'm gonna be standing by her bedside and be like, it's okay, honey. You're gonna be alright. Whatever your name was. It's, it's Everett. It, it's Eve. Emily. Eve. It's actually not Eve. It's ever. Damn. God. I'm thinking Wally. Eve. Let's go. We're so close. We're so close. Our dude is like, he's running on fumes. Look at his stamina bar. It's like a fraction of what it normally is. Alright, here we go. We're in. Who keeps closing this front door, damn it? Don't you understand? I come in here, and every time I gotta open that door, I gotta kick it open like a madman. Savages. Alright, there we go. Drop all this stuff off. Whatever we got. What is this? A drill press. Jesus. Now. Into the supply locker. Okay, got it. We now have enough plague samples to make the cure she needs. We should get on that as soon as possible. Let's do it. Ow. Alright, how do we do it? Craft medical items. Blood plague cure. Nice. Relax, babe. I have the cure in hand. You'll feel better in a sec. You're still working on that cure, right? I'm kind of dying here. I feel even worse than I look. I've got here. the cure. Here we go. I need you to hang in there. And how do we do this? Do I just stab it into her chest? Like like an adrenaline? Si oh god, right in the neck. Oh god. I guess if it's like life or death, that's an option, but otherwise, that's terrifying. I don't want to get stabbed in the neck with anything. I'm ready to get back in the game. Hey, neighbor. I saw you killing plague zombies out there. I came over to talk to you about getting rid of them for good. Oh, okay. Alright. My guy is tired. But I guess we'll talk to this, uh, this Kate... 
No, that's Juan. We'll talk to Kate wherever she is. Clear debris from home. I don't exactly know what she's talking about, debris. Dr. Brown. Yo, what's up, girl? Uh, plague plague zombies don't just wander to gather around plague hearts, but if you destroy the heart, you rid the air the... Take it easy. I'll talk to her in a minute, because I think we might be right here at the end for today's episode. I just wanted to see what this clear debris from home thing would be. Like, what's the debris? Is this the debris? Hmm. Oh, okay. Master bedroom repair. The facility's damaged and can't be used. This will take 30 minutes to fix this area. Okay, so that's, that's under construction. Alright, this area here looks good. Alright, I guess this I guess everything in here is okay. It was just oh okay, what's this? Command center. Base management. Open base screen. Hmm. Upgrade command center to level two. Alright, let's look at the base management. Let's see what the let's see what's going on here. We got storage, parking, parking, front, master bedroom. Now that we're fixing. Command center, double bunk room, storage is over there in that area, and the chef's kitchen. Hmm. We can deal with that. We don't have any outposts, but we can build some eventually. Trash, clearable. Let's do that too. And can I upgrade this? Also unlock. Searching for new territory, earning influence, and ability to add a facility mod. Okay, so we'll do that next. But alright, guys. I think that's going to be the end of this episode. We're, we're getting pretty long in the tooth here at the episode time. This guy definitely needs to take, take a break. So you know what? We're going to swap him out right the hell now, actually, before I forget. Because we can use the beds for that. Boom. Who do we got? Oh, we could literally play as anybody, pretty much. We don't have this guy. Choose a leader. When a survivor has maxed out their state, you may come here to select them as a leader. Survivors earn... Okay. We don't have that yet. My play is Brown. Who knows? We might play as ever in the next episode. Let's... How's he? He's good at shooting and fighting. And I forgot what she's good at. Gardening. Not really good at fighting. Take control. He's out here on the grill, and now all of a sudden he's just like... Argh! Somebody's taking control of me. Dude, look at this guy's gun. Holy crap. Anyway, before we get into all that, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you like this episode. I hope you like this content because I'm really going to be playing a lot of it. Uh, every day for the next week, maybe two weeks, I'm going to put out another episode of uh, State of Decay 2 just to cover like the launch period and everything like that. So if you guys are interested in it and you want to see more, check back every day. There's going to be another episode coming out. Thank you guys very much for stopping by and watching. If you like this episode, please leave a like. If you like this content, please consider subscribing. And hey, thank you guys very much. And as always, I will see you next time.